disaster unfolding overseas tonight in South Africa. Catastrophic flooding, nearly 450 people dead. Devastating fires in Australia, killing at least 18 people, forcing tens of thousands from their homes. The last decade was the Earth's warmest on record. 2019, the second hottest year Human ever. activities are leading to record amounts of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. December 17th, a young vendor named Mohamed Bouazizi was devastated when a police officer confiscated his cart. After local officials refused to hear his complaints, this young man went to the headquarters of the provincial government, doused himself in fuel, and lit himself on fire. spark for unprecedented protests that forced an autocratic president to flee and led to the Arab Spring that toppled regimes across the Middle East. Egypt, Syria, Libya, Iraq, Yemen. There were thousands of people protesting. Turning now to one of the deadliest conflicts in the world. Yemen's civil war has been going on for nearly three years. More than 10,000 people have died. Two million others have been displaced. The suspected drone attack could mark a major escalation. Eight million people are on the brink of famine. One of the world's worst humanitarian crises. And let me finally stress, there are no military solutions to this conflict. More needs to be done to really help Yemen tackle this crisis. 